So anytime we have a loss of fluid, a leaking radiator, a leaking uh, oil, what we really need to do, so we basically have main fluids, oil, we have uh, antifreeze, we have power steering fluid, power steering fluid, uh, we have on hydraulic fluid, fluids, brake fluid, and what am I missing here? Hydraulic oil. Hydraulic oil. What else do we have there? I think those are the main ones. So anytime we have a leak, if we have a leak, the question really becomes a little bit of how much are we leaking? So how much? Are we going through 10 liters a week? Are we going through 10 liters a day? This is the question to, to ask for, for our next step. We, we measure that by that. Uh, any hydraulic brake fluid will be leaking, that's a schedule one. That's an automatic fix. And we want to address it right away. Usually a brake fluid will probably be coming from Either a leak from a reservoir to a to a suction for feeding feeding our uh, pump, um, or what I found most of the times you usually had a caliper. We'll have a problem at a caliper, and the problem at the caliper, a lot of times uh, what will happen there is is it, we keep squeezing it out, and the caliper keeps coming out, and the rubber thing. Uh, really with that, I think the foundational problem of that is that we're really not checking the brakes. So for us to make sure that this doesn't happen, really we've got to be doing checking, checking, the, checking the status of the brake pad and replacing when it's needed. It's usually when, when the brake pad has is, is gone too far and now the pistons come out too far and the, and the uh, rubber on there has, has extended too far and is now weak. Gotcha.